see this one. Okay, now can you do it without no. leaning backwards? So sit back up. Sit back up. Get your leg. Okay. Now, I want you, without leaning way back, let me see you just try to lift that leg. Yes, there you go. All right, hold it there. Good job. What's up, what's up, Lee's family? I'm your girl, Glory Lee, and then what? House to busy. This is the day that the Lord has made. We will rejoice and be glad in it. I'm at Whole Food. I'm getting some stuff to um, cook for my sister's um, gathering that she's going to be having tomorrow at her house. So, I was supposed to be bringing um, cabbage. So, what I did was I want to try something different since I don't eat meat. I want to try something different. So, what I did was I had went here and bought some... Um, vegan bacon bits i'm gonna try to do vegan bacon bits with the um cabbage i had bought some vegan vanilla wafers because i want to do banana pudding so i bought vegan vanilla vanilla wafers vanilla pudding that's vegan so i, I bought a lot of vegan stuff even egg vegan eggs i gotta show y'all these eggs this the eggs are in a carton but they're not really eggs. They're like egg replacements. But I got to show y'all how this look. I, I had a choice to choose um, egg replacement in a bag or egg replacement in a carton. I chose the one in the, in the um, egg carton because I wanted to see how it looks. So I bought it. So I'll be showing y'all a little bit about the eggs. But yeah, I'm at the um, host food. I had to get all my vegan stuff. Um, to cook with for my family and also for my family that's coming over my sister's house. So, I'll see y'all guys in a little bit. All right. Hey, y'all. I'm trying to put away all of my groceries. We've been out ever since. We left the house, I say, around about 10 something. And it is just not like 4 o'clock. So we just now getting back in the house. We had to ride around places to get what I need. Because um, I'm vegetarian. My brother and his family um, vegans. So we had to. Well actually I had to ride around and try to find some stuff to cook. Not only for myself. Um, but for my um, brother and his family as well. So when you doing stuff um, over the holidays or. Whatever you plan on cooking for um, the family, you also have to be mindful of others, how others eat, you know, it's because you want them to eat with you. So it's not all about self. You have to um, learn to, you know, fix food what everybody else eats. So let me show y'all what I got. And excuse my kitchen, y'all. My I, It's messy right now. I don't like messy, but... Today is just messy because I didn't get a chance to clean it because I've been gone since this morning. Just come back in the afternoon. Um, and I'm not going to cook till like later on. Um, I'm going to take me and get me a rest before I start all this stuff. I have already added my um, vanilla um, pudding. My natural, simply delish vanilla pudding. I don't put some... I already had stirred my almond milk in it. It tastes so good, y'all. I just tasted it. So now I got my cookies. My vegan cookies, vanilla wafers. So I'm getting ready to layer that. So I'm just going to do... I'm trying to figure out should I put it in a pan. So, okay, guys. So I'm going to show you a little layer of what I'm getting ready to do with the vanilla wafers and the pudding. I'm going to show you the layers. Um, but I think I'm going to put it in the pan, but I'm going to put it in an aluminum pan. And then I'm going to put some wax paper in it as well. So I'm going to let y'all see it in a few minutes. I have layered my banana pudding with the vanilla wafers and the um, bananas. So I'm going to pour... I'm going to pour some pudding over it. So, let's see here. Pour a little pudding over it. 
Now if I pour a little pudding over it, then I'm going to add more cookies to it. See, some people, like my mom, she used to just do hers like really straight, like line them up and all the stuff. I don't got time for that, so I just pour the cookies on in there. Then I'm going to add more um, bananas on top, and then more cookies, then more banana pudding, and then top it off with the whipped cream, okay? My sisters. Yeah, you gotta open it up so they might see how it looks. That's a good thing. What's that? Uh, cologne? Oh, okay. Shower gel. I think it's shower gel. Oh, just go ahead and take your hands up. Remember what I said? Let me get up from here. Right. <laughs> right in it. Look here. What? That's my nephew's salad. Oh, that what's my bro? Look here. And you said nothing. Y'all still have a drawing on y'all table, I'll cook it. Huh? The Neymar, the Neymar yes, we do. And That's I should have bought it with me. It too. Somebody so took a house. dollar out of it. I was like, shit. I took a dollar. Yeah, I saw it. Oh, you yeah, I took a dollar. <laughs> Did you, did you put it back? I've been meaning to put it back in there. <laughs> I was going to take it. <laughs> I should have bought that, that John with me. Huh? I'm sorry how your phone said it worked. Because her message, Cause she, she got her message way to say it out loud. Her phone said it out loud. Really? And she meant to text it so my phone can talk out loud. I'm so mad. Well, what? You know Mary Poppins is out, right? Yeah. Did you ever go see Mary Poppins? Oh, I did I not. Matilda, That's what I want to say. Are the theaters open today? Yeah, they're right now. If anybody, you know, trying to go see the movie and all, you know. I'm broke. Huh? Yes. I'm vlogging. I mean, I'm vlogging. Girl, that's already I'm selling. No, I wasn't. Christmas left me with $4. Yeah, $4. $4? Christmas left me with $4. Yeah, Christmas left me with $4. Jesus bless her. And I asked her to show up for more. Lily's fan, this your girl, Glory Lee, in the house to be. This is Glory Lee Lee. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Thank you. 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 Thank um, morning this morning, but um, I saw this sitting out here, and I am very, very cold. I am cold, guys. Something had went up. Something had went on up the street. I don't know what happened. I don't know what somebody. Excuse me. I don't know what somebody got killed, um, shot, or something had happened up here in Wild North Carolina on Newbin Avenue. So you might want to go check on your loved ones done because I had some flat tires on my car but I don't know what in the world is going on up here but it's like two ambulances fire truck and about like six eight people. I mean they up here deep I don't know what in the world happened call for many There's something up here happening. Y'all see that? I don't know what in the world went down, but evidently they had this, they at the corner house. I think they had this red brick house or a house next to it, but they, they, I mean, they up here deep. Yeah, the 
This is going down on Newbin Avenue. I think it's, I know what channel, but they up there now. Hey to you, happy birthday to you. How old are you, Daddy? Uh-uh. 64. 64. Come on now. I know that's right, Daddy. I know that's right. Could have been all the way around. Could have been. That's right. It's a blessing. I'm still here, my But guess what? God said, not right now. That's right. That's right. Not right now. Elise fam, I hope everyone had a wonderful week. I did. I enjoyed my family on Tuesday. Um, this week was just kind of like a short week for me. Um, I only had to work for two days. But guess what? I'm counting down, guys, for the New Year's. Um, I just want to say to y'all um, right quick, um, God has been really dealing with me tremendously about some things because I've told God that I want to go all the way for him. And what I mean, I want to go all the way for the Lord. You know, my heart is right there. And he's dealing with me so tremendous. He's knocking at my door. And I open it up. And I want to go all the way for him. If that includes giving up some things and letting go of some loved ones that I love, you know, I would, I would do it. Because there's nothing like going on a vacation. And relax and enjoy yourself because you know that you enjoy as with Christ. You're in harmony with Jesus. And then on top of that, it's a freedom that you feel that you can be able to relax without stress, trouble, anxiety, all that stuff going in your mind. You're freed up with Christ because, hey, he makes you feel so good. He gives you that joy. He gives you that offspring of happiness that no man can give you. And I want that. If that means giving up some something I really love, truly love, and taking out some stuff to, to be different, to set up, be set apart, to bring his daughters in, I would do that. And I will do that. And in and, and order for you, if you talk about you love God, I love him. If anybody say you love God, you have to obey his commandments. You know saying keep his commandments. And go be great for God. And for one thing, don't forget how you start the year off is how you will end the year off. So keep God first, guys. I love you guys. Be